The story of the mother of Prophet Musa is one of the greatest testimonies to indeed with hardship comes ease. Inna ma'al usri yusra. As Pharaoh brutally murdered all the sons born to Bani Israel, the mother of Sayyidina Musa feared for her son's life. Commanded by Allah, she set Sayyidina Musa into the Nile River, not knowing where or what will become of this basket with her newborn son in it. وَأَوْحَيْنَا إِلَىٰ أُمِّ مُوسَىٰ أَنِ رُضِعِيهِ فَإِذَا خِفْتِ عَلَيْهِ فَأَلْقِيهِ فِي الْيَمْ وَلَا تَخَافِي وَلَا تَحْزَنِي إِنَّا رَدُّوهُ إِلَيْكِ وَجَاعِلُوهُ مِنَ الْمُرْسَلِينَ And we inspire to the mother of Musa, nurse him. But when you fear for him, cast him into the river, and do not fear and do not grieve. Indeed, we will return him to you, and we will make him one of the messengers. Imagine the pain of this mother's heart, placing your newborn son in a basket and setting him off into the waters. وَأَصْبَحَ فُؤَادُ أُمِّ مُوسَ فَارِغًا إِنْ كَادَتْ لِتَبْتَدِي بِهِ لَوْلَا أَنْ رَبَطْنَا عَلَى قَلْبِهَا لِتَكُونَ مِنَ الْمُؤْمِنِينَ And the heart of Moses' mother ached so much, that she almost gave away his identity, had we not reassured her heart in order for her to have faith in Allah's promise. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala wills for the baby to land in the palace of Fir'aun. SubhanAllah, this is the very place Prophet Musa's mother was trying to keep him away from. But Allah is surely the best of planners. There, Fir'aun's wife Sayyida Asiya takes in Prophet Musa and adopts him raising him as her own son. SubhanAllah once again, the very person Fir'aun feared the most was raised in his own palace. Allah's generosity extends to prevent Prophet Musa from accepting milk from any other woman until Prophet Musa's sister recommends Prophet Musa's very own mother to be the wet nurse. وَحَرَّمْنَا عَلَيْهِ الْمَرَاضِعَ مِنْ قَبْلِ فقالت هل أدلكم على أهل بيت يكفلونه لكم وهم له ناصحون. And we had caused him to refuse all the wet nurses at first. So his sister suggested, Shall I direct you to a family who will bring him up for you and take good care of him? The heart of Prophet Musa's mother is soothed and put at ease as she's reunited with her baby, knowing that he is now safe from the brutal killings of Fir'aun. We too often face circumstances in our life that make us feel stranded with little or no control over the situations at hand. Through the story of Prophet Musa's mother, we're reminded that when we do not know the plan, we undoubtedly need to trust the planner, the greatest of all planners, Al-Mudabbir. He will mold our trials and resilience into beautiful outcomes. We are reminded that your Lord has not forsaken you. Trust in your Lord and trust in his way. Know that with hardship comes ease. They come together, not one after the other. Please continue to join us and support us for Madistan's Embracing Resilience series where we will delve into stories of the trials and tribulations mentioned in the Qur'an and, through them, build a better understanding of how what we can do when we find ourselves faced with our own trials and tribulations.